Hello beautiful souls. Welcome to today's lesson as I actually get to share in glory of the joining with my brothers and sisters. This weekend has been so phenomenally beautiful and even our dishwasher is joining in our, in our talk today. That's how much joining is happening. <laughs> um, and actually today's lesson seems to be the theme of the weekend and everything that we have been continually reminded of and uh, the communications have always been around demonstrating this power of our holy self as being God's son. So today's lesson is perfectly fitting to complete off this most miraculous weekend for us here. And the lesson for today is, my holy self abides in you, God's son. My holy self abides in you, God's son. So we're affirming today that I am God's son. I am God's child. And it is my holy self that abides as God's son. It's my holy self also whole, complete, not split. This has also been a theme of the weekend. <laughs> that God isn't schizophrenic. <laughs> that God is whole, and so are we. And so this beautiful realization is uh, found in Lesson 266, and in our hearts and minds when we turn within there to listen. And so why don't we all do that here? As we gather in this prayer, that we may be reminded that my holy self abides in you, God's Son, my holy self does not abide in a body. My holy self abides in God's son. And so let's share in this prayer together today. Father, you gave me all your sons to be my saviors and my counselors in sight the bearers of your holy voice to me. In them are you reflected, and in them does Christ look back upon me from myself. Let not your son forget your holy name. Let not your son forget his holy source. Let not your son forget his name is yours. Oh my goodness. The curriculum is so divine. And this is it. This is what we've been celebrating in. That we are equal sons of God. And we are all part of this process together. To be each other's saviors. To be each other's counselors. To be each other's reminders of what we are. To be the bringers of sight. To be the bringers of the gifts of salvation. To bear our Father's holy voice. Can I get an amen? Amen. amen. That's it, joining in this holy place. Let us not forget that this is my name. Let me not forget that your son is my holy name. And being God's son, that is my name. That is what I am. Let me not forget my source. Let your son not forget who he is. It is only in forgetting who we are that we experience pain of any kind, fear of any kind. And yet in remembering and celebrating together, our joint power is being God's children. We are free. We are saved. And then we can help save. And this is what we bring to each other by being together. And this is what I'm so humbled to reside within. Knowing that in our minds and the shared experience of being God's equal son, that is where happiness. <laughs> and look at this now. Ready? This day, we enter into paradise, calling upon God's name and on our own, acknowledging ourself in each of us, united in the holy love of God. How many saviors God has given us? How can we lose the way to him 
when he has filled the world with those who point to him and given us the sight to look on them. How much hope does this bring the mind? How much faith does this fill the heart? This day we enter into paradise, calling upon God's name and on our own. Acknowledging the self, capital S, in each of us, united in the holy love of God. This is where we have shared communication. This is where we have shared experience. This is where we recognize our shared purpose. This is where we recognize our shared identity. And this is where we have a miracle of heaven and reside in the joy of paradise, the unchanging realm of paradise. This is no longer some talk. This is actual experience that is shared among sons of God. And that is you and that is me and that is all of us here. And we are learning to remember that this is the only thing that will fill us with peace. And this will be the only thing that saves our life. And this will be the only thing that saves the world. For God is life. God is the giver of life. And this gift has already been given us to be realized. In our acceptance of it, so is it done in our life. How could we lose the way to him when he has filled the world with those who point to him and given us the sight to look upon him? Let's not lose sight of this sight today. Of all of our holy brothers who are pointing the way to God, all we need to do is listen and to see. If we look for it, boom, it is there. So let's look for that today and not forget who we are and not forget our holy name and not forget our holy source. And remember that our brothers and sisters are here and they are saviors of the world with us. They are our counselors and the bringers of sight and salvation. We are doing this together, holy and completely and truly beautiful souls. I am so thankful. And so today's lesson, my holy self abides in you, God's son. Yes, affirmative. I love you, beautiful souls. Enjoy today's most holy lesson. Mwah.